Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back to Sim UK. Welcome back to La Prison. Hope everybody's doing well. Um, I think what we're going to do here, because the graphics are looking a little bit shaky right now, um, we're just going to drop. Ooh. Some stuff down to medium. Just a few little bits. I think this is something that's going to get fixed. Um, yeah, I think it's something that's going to get fixed for release. Oh, there we go. That feels that feels a little bit better. What is that? Right, I don't know. Anyway, guys, how you doing? Welcome back. Sim UK here, and we're going to continue with our second week as a prison officer. Um, it looks like we've got to go talk to Kenneth Duncan as well as find those 10 cookies. Kenneth Duncan, I think, if memory serves, is the, um, what's his name? He's the main man, isn't he? It's this way. I'm trying to remember where I am. Here we go. The Warden. Yes, it is indeed. Hello, Kenneth. He has news for us. It's about the murder. The court has decided that Paul Taylor deserves a more severe punishment. Uh-oh. No. How many more years do they give him? They gave him the chair. No way! They gave him the chair! That's not all. The day of the execution is tomorrow and you're the one who's going to carry out the sentence. No effing way. That's a big responsibility. Don't worry, you'll be fine. Will I? Anyway, I'm not taking no for an answer. Won't you? <laughs> okay, I have a little truncheon that might have something to say about that. Glad that you agree. Yeah. For now, go back to your duties and don't think too much about it. Remember, he's a murderer. Is he, though? Is he, though? He doesn't deserve our sympathy. Yeah, okay. Um, just whilst I'm here, copper, 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 copper. Just, I think I can log into his account, you know. I think he's I think he's dodgy. I think he's well dodgy. Right, so listen. Um, taser. I can't buy it because I need to be level 7. Pepper spray? 200 bloody dollars for that. Is that out of my money or out of prison money? That's out of my money. Dang! Serious. What about a vest? That's 300. I can't even buy that yet. What about a gun? Skins. Oh, wait, hang on. Have I got a gun? I don't have a gun. Why does it think I have a gun? Do I have a gun? If I have a gun, I don't know how to... Uh, how to get it. Alright, so it's a thousand dollars for decent bedding. And we're not far off that, actually. We're not far off that at all. What have we got to do today? Let's have a look. Shower time! Oh my god, there's a lot going on today. So, okay. Oh, man. I'm going to get banned by YouTube with this game. <laughs> shower time. During the shower routine, give prisoners clean towels so they can take a shower. Collect the dirty towels and put them away so that the shower is ready for the next prisoner. Be aware of the prisoner's patience or they will leave the room. So the more uh, prisoners that have a shower, the more money I earn, apparently. Not quite sure why that is. Check the parcels and a prison stroll. Side quest, beating and a cookie monster. And then the death penalty. Oh my god, it's a busy ass day. Holy blimey gananas. Gananas? I don't even know what that is. It's a combination of some stuff I don't even know. Showers. Prisoners who are waiting for their turn to shower have different levels of patience depending on their character. Aggressive, neutral and gentle. Aggressive people are the least patient. So appoint them first in order. Walk to the bin with clean towels to hand them to the prisoners. Without them, they will not go into the shower. Give the selected prisoner a clean towel. He will go to the nearest free cabin. If all cabins are busy, 
You need to wait with the tail distribution. Alright. Uh, so he's neutral, mm. neutral, aggressive. Yeah, Richard, get in there, mate. Don't talk to me like that or I'll slap your head in. That's right. Very mm. good. So there's only three showers. He's harmless. He can go in. No free cabins. Okay, routine showers. When a prisoner gets tired of waiting, he'll just miss his shower day and you'll have a smaller chance of getting a big bonus. Sometimes a bored prisoner can attack someone. Then he should be pacified. Uh, boys. What the hell were you going? Oi! Oh, what's going on here? So, oh, okay, you can't see nothing in the shower. Actually, you can see something in the shower. That's a little bit rude. Uh, loads of ducks everywhere. Why did the other guys walk off? They're the passive, more relaxed ones. That's weird. Okay. He's aggressive and he's neutral. All right. Uh, when the prisoner takes a shower, you have to collect a dirty towel from him. Otherwise, he will be blocking a cabin. But dirty towels in the dirty laundry bin, you'll find it near the cabins. Remember that a minimum number of prisoners have to take a shower. The more prisoners who take a shower, the bigger bonus you'll get. Right. Oh my god, it is so awkward to get this towel off them. That is ridiculously annoying. Thank you. Oh, you can see the patients above their head now. Son of a bitch. Stupid idiot. Unbelievable. Right, your patience is nearly up. Your patience is gone, you can go. Go on. Don't look at me like that. Seriously. I'm not in the mood today. I'm going to kill a man later. I could be killing too. Do you know what I'm saying? Do you understand? We need to get these extra showers open. This is awkward. How long? 12 seconds, 4 seconds. Right, come here. Hurry up. I like the way he's instantly dressed before he even comes out. That's pretty groovy. Yeah, here, here, here. Alright, screw you. You go have a shower instead. It's weird, I can't do anything with that. That is odd. Yeah, it's too difficult to get the... You have to stand right bang in front of them. You can't be like off to an angle or anything like that. Okay, so I was trying to read their stats to see how patient they are, but... Actually, has nothing to do with that. It's just this thing above their head. Be like, he's aggressive and his patience is already. It's going up. It's going up. Oh, so when it gets to maximum, I thought it would go down. Logically, you would expect it to be going down, not up. Who does things logically around here? Go on. Go have a shower, mate. Why is he walking with. What are you looking at? Bloody weirdo. Can I help you, fat boy? Yeah. That's what I thought. Alrighty, this is weird and tricky and odd. Take that, go and have a shower. Yeah, 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 whatever you say. This is awkward. Uh... He seems pretty chilled out. Right, anyone finished? You're nearly finished. Come on, be quick. Ah, that's the that's the quickest way. Take it before he even gets out of the shower. That's the way forward. Uh, you're both gonna. Oh, you're kidding me! I failed. Failed. Damn it! How do I get this out of my hand? So he's stuck in there forever. 
That's weird. I don't understand. I'm on a break. I don't care. That was weird as well. <laughs> ah, you know what we need to do? We need to go shoot something in the face. Nope. Let's do some darts. We haven't done darts for ages. I've got to get some more cookies as well. Hey, man. Miguel. Yeah, we'll play some darts. Uh, what do I want to play? I don't know. Let's go for... Let's go for... Let's go for baseball. I don't know what that is. Okay. Uh, yes, we'll put a bet in. Let's go 30 bucks. Yes. Players try to score as many runs as possible per inning. The goal is to hit the number on the board that corresponds to the current inning. For example, in the first inning, players can only hit a one in order to score runs. For any inning, a single is one run. A double is two runs and a triple is three runs. Got you. At the end of the nine innings, the player with the most runs wins. If the players are tied at the end of the nine innings, extra in innings can be played until someone wins. So we're going for number one here. Oh. Okay, that's tricky. Yes, I got a triple, I think. So we're after number two now, yeah? Oh, God. I totally screwed up there, didn't I? I've no idea what the score is right now. That was a pretty good score. Uh, what are we on? Number four. Oh, God. Okay, he's got 14, I got 23. I'm kicking his ass then. Uh, what are we on now? Five? I've nailed this. How many flipping innings are there? 30, 15. I'm not sure he can even catch me up, can he? Where's number six? Six, 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 six. I'm quite far ahead now. Oh no. Don't start missing. There's eight. There she is. I think we've won. Got nearly double his score. That was terrible. Perfect. And a miss. I'm getting worse as I play, not better. Okay, we're off to the parcel searching room. Hey, maybe I'll find some cookies. That'd be nice. So this is Richard Bundy's... Oh, hang on. Am I supposed to be taking Richard Bundy's stuff? Because this is, this is part of the deal, right? He said, the first time you do it, I'll let you get away with it. Was it Richard Bundy? Who was it? I mean... <laughs> Damn, I just realised suddenly... worth $45 oh my god I don't think I'm in cahoots with him I can't remember who I'm in cahoots with but I don't think it's him
I don't think. I'm going to have to check his name because I could I could be getting myself into a lot of trouble here. Donald. It's definitely not Donald. So if there's anything in Donald's package, then uh, it's going to get found and dealt with. Nope, nothing in there at all. Okay, that's good. That can go back on the shelf. I saw something then. Apparently not. Imagining it. That all looks good. Oh, I hope it wasn't. What's his, what's his name? That doesn't tell me anymore. Matthew Martin. I don't think it's him either. But I am going to have to check his name because if his stuff comes in, I've got to leave it. I've got to not, not even bother looking at it, really. Or maybe I could look at it just so I know what he's got. There's only one box that came in today with stuff in it, really. Right, so we've got the shooting range. I think we're going to go shoot some people. It's been that kind of day. We, we're having a bit of a stressful day, let's be honest. The stress levels are pretty high. And we haven't even got 10 cookies. I mean, come on. Here we go. Go for the rifle. Let's see if we can do better than we did last time. Go. That's pretty good. One hundred percent accuracy. Beat that bitch. I only got 51 points though. I got one point more than I did with 90% accuracy, but I was a lot quicker. A good five seconds quicker, so that was pretty good. Got to be happy with that. Got to be happy with that. All right. What now? What now? Where are we going now? The prison stroll. Okay, we're outside. I've got to find some damn cookies. Where can I get cookies from? Are there cookies in here? No. That's milk chocolate. Well, I just want one. And what's this? Dried beef, nachos, chips, cola, orange aid, chocolate bar, multivitamin juice. Drinking multivitamin and return to life restores HP up to 70%. Up to 70%! Alright, we'll just buy one of those. So, okay, good. Do you want to get it in the snail? Very nice, isn't it? So he wants cookies off me. Right, what is this guy's name? Corey Thompson. Right, that's who I'm working with. His ass is always itchy, that bloke. Right, one thing I've discovered, by the way, guys, uh, is that on the uh, Steam Achievements list, I have got a lot. Oh, look, time-sensitive request. He wanted someone beaten up. Who was it he wanted beaten up? Paul Taylor. Where is Paul Taylor? I don't remember what Paul Taylor looks like. Uh, but yeah, anyway, I've got the uh, award for beating up lots of people for no good reason whatsoever. Um, so I'm going to have to stop that. Me too. 
Nobody's kicking off today. It's weird. Uh, what are you doing, Matthew? You wonder how Mum's doing. You know there's nothing the other side of this fence, right? I'm just going to search you. Apparently you don't have anything contrabandy on you, which is very lucky for you, isn't it? I'm pretty sure that's a bug. That doesn't make any sense, as is. Mark Gomez, Matthew Smith, Donald Wilson, Michael Jones, Brian Moore. Where is this guy, then? Don't even know where he is. Alright, we're going to give him a bit of extra time today. Bruce O'Neill. It's Corey. It's Van Hans. Ricky. Donald. Hmm. It's weird. But we're going to give him as much extra time out here as we can. I can't believe no one's kicking off and fighting. That's the first time ever. Normally there's like four or five different fights going on. It's Hans. It's Bruce. Look at that. 100% on the prisoner guards. 44.6% on the prisoners. I can't believe I'm doing this well. He's going to be annoyed with me if Paul doesn't get beaten up, though. Remind me again. Paul... who? Paul Taylor. Paul Taylor. Okay. Jim, do you know who Paul Taylor is? Just trying to figure it out, boys. That's Hans... I must have looked at hands about nine times already. But. Hey, 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 hey. I don't talk to screws, especially you. I'm going to search you whilst you're peeing. Stop peeing. Right, let's call him in. Oh, that's it. It's over. Mission complete. It's got to be a way for me to put my hands away without having to do this every time. Can I just... No, there's no way of quickly just going back to normal, is there? Yeah, there's a few things I'd like to change in this game, I think. Right, so what are we up to now? Uh, well, that's it. That's it. Shower time. We've, that's the first thing we failed, is shower time. We're going to fail the beating as well, though, because my plan for the beating was to invite lots of people who don't like him to the same location and let them have a little bit of uh, a chat. So that has not gone well. The whole cookie thing is proving to be more difficult than I realised as well. And at this moment in time, I've no idea where Paul Taylor actually is. So, uh, yeah, one or two little problems. Hello, uh, Flint. Daniel. Yeah, desde la paca to you too, mate. Right, where is Paul? Let's have a look here. It's Brian Moore. I think Paul is over here somewhere, isn't he? I well, there's nobody in there now, because he's on death row, mate. Donald Duke, Gene, Charles, Brian. There's nobody in there, because he died. Corey Thompson, Bruce O'Neill. We don't do anything with Corey's stuff. Jim Lee, Richard Bundy, William Harris, Michael Jones, Harris, I Williams. Where the hell is he, then? Hang on, is Paul Taylor a copper? No, he can't be. I'm most confused. I don't know where Paul Taylor is. I haven't a clue. Huh? Uh, I give up. I don't know where he is. Alright, <clears throat> looks like we're going to go to the end of the day. We'll see how things go from here.
Are we done for today? Yes, I think so. As best as we can do. Level six. We made 43 extra dollars today, 131 for the prison. I am going to get them some clean bedding because the bedding is disgusting. Guards' respect went down by 9% because I didn't get Paul Taylor beaten up. Prisoner respect went up by 4%, so that's now 46%. That's really good. Right whisk, risk, whisk went down by another 1%, so that's good as well. We actually had a good day, but I think tomorrow... Um, we're going to be on death row duty, and that is quite scary. So join me for that, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.